Hi, this is Jenny and I am on the spot. It is approximately two days before I turn a fourth decade old, young. Oh, hi, Kevin. Don't knock over the camera. I just started filming. So, anywho, uh, I'm turning, uh, you know, we're getting older every day. Can you go close my door? I had the door closed so I could have some quiet. And if you leave, I will give you what you want later. I can't say B-O-N. I can't say B-O-N-E. I can't spell B-O-N-E, because he knows what I'm talking about. None of us are getting any younger, so I think we're all in the same boat when it comes to that, but some of us are closer to the bigger numbers. I've never been a fan of, of aging, ever. I remember when I turned 20, that was difficult for me. I've always been wise beyond my years. I knew that being an adult wasn't all that it was cracked up to be. I was smart. I was like, I want to be a kid forever, right? Forever, forever, forever. You know, my birthday's coming. And uh, so I thought, you know, I, I, I want to, I would be remiss if I did not um, chronicle it in some way, video, some video way. I'm going to show you this real quick. This is um, actually a present. A present that just came in the mail yesterday from my friend Stacy. It's it's a clock, but it's a record. But what is especially significant about this is that it's a Duran Duran record. Moon on Monday, yeah. So as uh, I have a special connection with Duran Duran, uh, Simon Le Bon and I have the same birthday. He's at least a decade older than me, maybe a decade and a half. So anyway, Simon, Levon, and I, we go way back. I've tweeted at him before. He's never said a word. It doesn't hurt my feelings. I'm, I know my space. I know my spot in life. But for my birthday week, what have I done? Uh, I decided instead of chasing a bunch of activities and uh, that sort of thing, I decided for my birthday week, the thing I wanted to do the most was sleep. <laughs> Every night for the past, I'm gonna let Kevin outside. Hold on, come here. You know what, people? Sleep is like magic. It sleep is like the sleep is the fountain of youth. I'm not kidding you. And also weight loss. I've lost three pounds. So that was one. That was like the gift I've given myself this birthday week. What else can be great about forty? There, I said it. Um, what did I, what did I have in my head? Oh gosh. Uh, consistent moisturizing. And actually I was a, um, little camp counselor type person for my daughter's fourth grade trip last year. And I had about five fourth grade girls in my cabin. And I said, girls, if you take nothing from this, camp experience away, but this one thing. And that one thing that I told them was moisturize. I don't care if you're nine, 10 years old, their moisturization will never, oh Kevin, moisturization will never steer you wrong. Something else I've noticed as I've aged is my taste buds are a little less sharp. So I like my coffee stronger and I like my food hotter buds are slowly dying off. Actually, um, turning 40 is becoming the, the, the age of more. More moisturization and more spicy foods and more sleep. So let this be the year to sparkle and have more of things like moisturizer. I think that's about it. I'm just gonna be diving in here. Gonna try to not be terribly upset about it, but embrace it for the good changes that I get to make. And in uh, my my blog post that I'll link here in the description, I actually have come up with my life list or life menu. 
and that's gonna that's a fun little list of things to shoot for to look forward to in 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 the next in the next um the new horizon so I'm wondering, I'll ask you this question, not that it, people really answer my questions. Anyways, do you have a life? <laughs> do you have a life list? Anywho, I don't know how to wrap this up. Okay, I gotta go. Bye, peace, peace and sparkles. Bye.